Hello guys, welcome back to American Truck Simulator. So today guys, I mentioned we're going to start doing some modded truck runs. Just a regular run. And what we're going to do, we're going to do a regular run of the truck. Then we're going to do a, uh, a mod review of the truck. And then we're going to do a, a live stream with it. Before we end it. So today we're going to be using the Ford 9000 modded truck. We're going to do a, a regular run with it today. Uh, this week, sometimes we'll be a live stream with the truck. The live stream will probably come out before this video will, I, I honest with you. Um, and then we'll be, I will do a mod review of the truck after the live stream. Let's go, Ruth. So we'll bring a little bit more content to the channel, you know, we'll bring a little bit more ATS. So here's the interior of this uh, Ford 9000. Today the truck's running a, a, a Cummins 444. So we're in um, Flagstaff. We're heading down to Farmington. Got some construction equipment. Turn left. Hope you guys are doing well. Man, this truck doesn't have a shifter. It may have been automatic. I mean, I'm not really sure. It's kind of it's kind of bone shot when it comes to the inside. There's not really a lot you can do. Where the um, trailer brake and uh, brake, yeah, air brakes is where you just pull it with your hand right there. Get ready to turn I like the way right. they got this set up. Well, you know, I'm trying to get in and do some different type of content, not just play ATS and LSB Devour. I, I want to bring in, you know, do, do different types of games. So I have been working on some different types of content too to go along with these stuff. And I'm always looking for new stuff to play. There is some more stuff coming later this year that we're going to be looking at, most definitely. Get any power. It's a uh, 444 run about 430 horsepower, so it, it should do pretty good. Oh, I think she's gonna be a floater. And get us a thumbnail real quick. We're gonna go ahead and come around this way with it. Bring out just a little bit.
come on for a minute here. Get that 75. Well, sure, I should get on down the road now. Uh, we got 224 miles to go. Should not take long with this 75 mile speed limit, to be honest with you. I like the fact the placement of the, of the truck though, I feel like it's off. Everything you know, they was into trucks, they was into you know, tractors, and you know, they was just about everything. Okay, guys, different stuff to play. If you have not heard, Rockstar did finally announce GTA 6. We all knew it was in development. Um, they did put a release date around October of 24, which means that will be only for console. It will it will come out six months to a year later on PC. To make it, which would make it, uh, and I don't know why it's doing that. I might look at that. I do apologize, I don't know what's called in that. I'm thinking it's a graphics mod. I'm gonna remove that graphics mod, but, anyways, um, which would make it about six months to a year later on the 25 for your PC. Then you have, you'd have six months to, uh, about six months a year when you start seeing mods really start coming out. We all knew it was coming. We knew a long time ago that they were working on it. They had a fish in now. I don't know what that is. Might remove that graphics mod and see if that graphics mod is called tonight. It's worth losing texture right there for some reason. Got 142 miles to go.
I might adjust the mirrors on it. That mirror on that side is way off. You can't even see out of that mirror. That's a little bit better. Bring it up a little bit where we can see out of it. I'm gonna have to bring the side mirror in though, the little small mirror. I'm gonna bring this mirror over. We can kind of see out the mirror. Need to be adjusted. It was bad. while before we will see GTA 6 for us on the channel um, and when it comes out the problem we're gonna have is too if they're gonna release it for Steam we don't know that uh, there'll be a fool not release it the first day but we don't know what Rockstar is planning on that because when they released Red Dead Redemption 2 they released it for Epic Game Store first which was a mistake They may be playing the same thing with GTA 6. We don't know yet. We got 111 miles to go. Donut would look a little bit better. I think there they would have put maybe like a bite out of the donut. Lights or our lights are on.
That's something that they need to have when you turn it on and off. sir. Jake break you very quiet for this uh, 444. Seventy miles ago. So look at the sights, but we have nothing but rain on this trip. Look, uh, looks like about a 50 something forward. Like a 52 forward. Regular horn, huh? Thirty-two miles to go. About a feet to keep forward.
That's when the cars are actually good cars to what they are now. Now they're garbage. Compared to that right there. Looking around the cab, it's not a bad looking truck though. It's a uh, pretty good quality. It just is kind of plain. Which now these trucks here, they were they they were workhorses. You know, they was a. Uh, what they was for. They were workhorses. It wasn't really designed back then for luxury. Not bad looking truck, though. I don't like the fact you don't have no hood mirrors. I like my truck with hood mirrors. And guys, you know me on these videos. A lot of times, they, I'm kind of quiet because I want you guys to hear the engine. Which this is kind of quiet. The truck's kind of quiet. This is the J brake, and you know, look at the sights, and you know. And unfortunately today, all we've had it rain, so. Let 
this out. Thank you. A little bit of a lag spike there, that's okay. Come, we don't come to these much. Now this cargo pack, this is actually a mod. Very well done one too, I would say. Now this is one of them fog lights light lit up on the bumper they do. We drove exit 281 miles, took us 5 hours and 48 minutes to get here. We consumed 38.5 gallons of fuel. Hook up this other truck because I'm going to be using this truck for a live stream and for a mod review. So uh, we'll go ahead and hook up to this truck.
this could be of the day's video. Like I said, I, this is something I'm going to try to start doing is more of these, uh, I do the, you know, the, the just the regular runs here at ATS for the SCS trucks. So I want to try to start doing some of that with some of the modded trucks that I see that every time I look, you know, the ones that's, that's being updated and, you know, that in no time they're updated on the next version of the game. The 1.4.8, let not, as of right now, we're on 1.4.8. But well, this truck was one of them that was updated earlier uh, for the new version of the game. So, want to get in, you know, check it out. I've never really used it, so we want to get in and do a run. We're going to do a live stream with it. We're going to do a, um, and then a modded truck review. We're going to kind of start getting more in, in detail with these trucks uh, when we do these videos. Real company runs are coming back. I've got one set up I'm going to do for that also. So, yeah, a lot more content's coming for ATS and LSP Tower and other content. So, Thank you everyone who's been watching and who's been subscribed to the channel. It means a lot helps the channel grow. And we'll see you in the next video.